Welcome back to Tennis Talk. My name's Cam Williams, and with Wimbledon just around the corner, we have a lot of players that are not playing Wimbledon, of course, this year because of the ban to Russian and Belarusian players. But there are also some players that are injured who won't be playing Wimbledon. Let's go check out the list. So let's start with the WTA. We have, of course, Sabalenka not playing because she is Belarusian. She's not allowed to play. Azarenka, the same as Sabalenka, not allowed to play. Alexandrova is also not playing Wimbledon. Kazakina is also out of Wimbledon. Kudamatova, again, just like all the other Russians, cannot play Wimbledon this year. Sasnovich also out of Wimbledon. Pavlyuchenko is also out of Wimbledon. I think she is also injured as well. So maybe a little bit of both being Russian and also injured. She might not have played anyway. Samsonova, again, just like all the other Russians, cannot play Wimbledon this year. We've also got Gracheva, she's out. Potapova is also out. Kalinskaya, also out. Now Svetolina is out. She is out because she's actually having a baby soon, so she's not playing for the foreseeable future. Wondrusova is also out. She's out with injury. Christian is also out with injury. Leila Fernandez, she's out with that foot injury. We won't be seeing her for a long time, possibly until the US Open at this stage. And Sharif is also out injured from Wimbledon this year. Having a look at the players that are out for the men this year, we have Medvedev. Of course, he's out. Hashinov is also out, both because the Russians are not allowed to play. Federer is also out. We know that. He won't be back for a while. Rublev, he also won't be playing Wimbledon this year. Harris is also out. I think he might be injured, so he won't be playing. Avashka won't be playing. Karatsev also won't be playing due to injury. And of course, Alexander Zverev, he will be out for a long time, possibly until the US Open, due to that ankle injury. So some big names not playing for the men's side. Three of the top 10 players not playing at this stage. So there you have it. They are the players not playing at Wimbledon this year. And there's some massive names. Most of them are actually healthy and can play. And most of them are actually playing warm-up events to Wimbledon just to get some extra points. But a lot of them not playing Wimbledon itself. And of course, we've got some injuries. Some massive injuries to guys like Zverev who got injured at the French Open and can't play either. So the tournament's looking pretty bare. And of course, we've still got to wait for Rafa and Raducanu to see what they are going to do because they both have injuries at the moment as well. So let me know down in the comments below, who are you going to miss the most at Wimbledon this year? And also, do you think it's going to be seen as a lesser tournament? I know people are saying that it's not really worth the same because it's not worth points. But at the end of the day, it's still a Grand Slam and it's still Wimbledon. And whoever wins is going to win Wimbledon at the end of the day. But let me know down in the comments below, what are your thoughts about Wimbledon this year?